Justin, say hi. We're out and about today in the middle of Crown Land again because the range is still burnt down. We're gonna do some shotgun shooting. The comments went kind of crazy in one of my shorts for some reason saying that small barrel means more recoil, but people were saying longer barrel equals more muzzle power, therefore more recoil. So this is what we got going today. Those two, those are fun ones. Those are for the end of the video. This is what we're comparing today. I got a eight and a half inch Boito 12 gauge and a, what, like a 20 inch Kui 12 gauge. If that one breaks, it breaks. That's just how it's gonna be. I do actually have a bunch of different kinds of shots today. Some that you guys weren't ready for. I have some three inch buck shot. We got some three inch high brass <laughs> bird shot and some Double lot buck and two and three quarter. Uh, we have target load. Let me just show you guys how the guns work and then I'll get you guys to have fun with them because I want you guys to have fun with them. Eight and a half inch 12 gauge first. Just gonna go with the, why not, foul. Start off, start off big, right? Go big or go home? Yep. I wanna know what recoil is worse and which ones. I'm, that's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna send two with this and I'm gonna send two with this. And then I'm gonna decide on what I think is worse and I'll get you guys to do the same. Okay. The safety has to be off in order to pull the hammer back. The safest part to technically grab is this right here because that is how you break it open. But don't fling it around with your finger across. Anyway, loading the right one in. So this is two and three quarter bird shot. You watching everything? It's not all on like my feet. No, it's up top. Oh, okay, cool. I guess I'm just gonna go for that close target. Or no, I'll go for the middle target. Is that cool? Sure. Okay, so three inch now. That, that had a little bit more kick to it. It was not. Mm. The way this one works is it's the uh, mechanism on the back here. All right. So, the hammer fire. There is no safety. Yeah, I don't, no idea where it is. It is its own safety. It, it's its own safety, apparently. Uh. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's awesome. I love having ejectors. All right. Hmm. I don't feel a difference. All right, we're live. What you going for? Three and a half inch? Or no, you're doing two and three quarter first? Two and three quarter, the little one. Yeah, I was just wondering what target you're going for. That one. Okay. He's like, gotta pull the hammer back. There you go. What do you think of that guy? It's not bad, actually. <laughs> not the same. All right, and then... I'll go for the medium one. There you go. Right? It's like... Yeah, they're the exact same. Basically the same thing. Not too bad, right? Okay, so now... Load up uh, that Kui. <sighs> nice, nice. So what do you think? Which one had the most kick? That one by a little bit. The Kui just by a little the bit. The Kui just by a little bit? Yeah, and it was the bigger slug that had more. So, like, okay, so so it. the way it seems is two and three quarter, it doesn't really matter too much when it comes to barrel length. The kick is still the same, but once you start getting into the three inch at least, the kick is a little bit more because I think it's got more time to burn up that gunpowder. Yeah, two and three quarter first. Wrecked him. Ooh, that was a sweet fireball on that one. I hope the camera got it. Hmm.
Verdict? Three inch this one kicks more, otherwise it don't matter. Great, okay, so two and three quarter, it doesn't matter, they feel the same. But the three inch, it feels like more because it's got more time to burn that extra powder. Dirt. <laughs> Uh, this one will probably feel a big difference. Yeah, we might feel a difference with this one. Everybody was always saying, like, the big turtle. Whoa! Why aren't they orange? Apparently they're... they're orange. This is kind of cool. That's what's in it. Why aren't they orange? They might have changed ammunition supplier. Maybe. They used to be low brass, too. Look at these things. They used to be orange. This is fancy. Yeah. You see the wad and everything. It's bougie up in here. That's kind of cool. <laughs> All right, so we got double out buck and two and three quarter, and then we also got double out buck and three inch. Okay. Two and three quarter inch, double out buck first. Somewhere around oh, it. That felt good. That, that felt different good. than the orange ones. They might have changed something up. They might have changed something up. Here, let me let me see something. There's only one way that I'll know, okay? Ah, oh, I was going for that target. It's close. You're around it. That was close. Okay, it still feels the same. But anyways, three inch. <laughs> Make contact good. with one of them on that one. Definitely. Okay, so now it's the Cooey's turn. <laughs> uh, this thing is cool. I love the uh the ejector. <laughs> now remember, accuracy by point. Accuracy by point. Oh wow. Yeah, so you don't have to uh aim two feet low. No. <laughs> you have to just aim right at it. That one you have to aim two feet low to be accurate. It's accuracy by point. There. By point. So now we're doing the three inch. Don't blow up on me. Ooh. I felt that. Oh no. <laughs> so you don't have to one hand it. Um, some people do like mad men. I wouldn't know him. What you going for? The um, medium bottle. Okay. You have to aim like two feet low for that yeah, one. Yeah, I realize that. <laughs> so that was just the uh, two and three quarter inch buckshot, double out buck. And this is the three inch double out buck. Nice. Ooh, felt that one. It looked good. That's a sweet little rig, isn't it? It is. All right, so now it's the Cooey's turn. You gotta give it a little love boop, little, little boop. there we go. <sighs> that one you aim directly at, basically. There you go. All right, you'll feel this one. Oh, yep, felt that one. <laughs> <laughs> so what do you think, same same verdict, more or less? It's like, yeah. okay, yeah, it is the same, verdict. same verdict. So eight, so eight and a half inch. Um, is perfect for a two and three quarter because all the powder is probably burnt up right by then. But the three inch, it needs more time to burn. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> it's a good thing tomorrow's Sunday. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Thank God we don't got to work tomorrow. Yeah, I'll just save for the old paper. Go for it. I think you got it. With one, at least. Oh, that looked good. <laughs> Looks like I've done this before. <laughs> but have we done it consecutively with this Kui? No. <laughs> yeah, I think blow up. Yeah, I know. I want it to blow up on me. <laughs> I'd love to say that on camera, Chris. <laughs> <laughs> if you get anything on camera, it's a good idea. Yeah. <laughs> Did it just eject? Yeah, I didn't quite fully close it. Okay. <laughs> All right. Two and three quarter buckshot. Ooh, that ejector must be worn or something. Hmm. And then three inch buckshot. Why do I agree to this stuff? 
Wrecked him. That was awesome. Verdict? That definitely. Yeah. So it's the th three okay. inch out of that. Don't feel it. Three inch out of this. Yes. Okay. Okay. That makes. That's actually a good experiment. This is yeah. good. This is good. Oh, which one we're taking hunting though? My experiment's basically over, so now it's just time to have some fun. Okay. Let's do it. Let's wreck them. How fast I can shoot? <laughs> we should do like little drills. <laughs> <laughs> From not with the buck shot. <laughs> God. As long as it's not with the three inch. Yeah, I want to feel my shoulder tomorrow. Well, the bird shot okay, is okay. Well, the buck shot. Yeah, the buck shot's a little expensive. I don't have too much of that, so you can only do a couple things with that. So this is the three inch bird shot. I'm just gonna see how fast I can shoot three consecutively. Uh, this is inconvenient when. There we go. Now it's not. <laughs> How do I make it look cool? It didn't eject the last one. <laughs> How'd that feel? Pretty good. Manly. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> I don't even have to shoot a gun. I just have to hold it and I'm yeah. buff. I'm not gonna put a timer on it. You wanna know why? Because we're all winners. There ain't no participation medals in this. <laughs> that ain't what we aiming for. <laughs> Should I do a quick thank you to this thank you to the CCFR for uh, being awesome Cana the Canadian Coalition for Firearms Rights, allowing us folks to go out to a safe location and have a good time safely with firearms and whatnot. So go out and get your pals, Canadians. Yeah. What do you think we should do next? What's the next drill? We're doing, we're going, we're each going to just pick one. And fire three out of the short one. <laughs> okay. You first. All right. <laughs> you know, I think we should do a redo because you fumbled it at the beginning. <laughs> you go next. No, redo. Oh, looks so good with all that smoke. <laughs> nice. Everybody here is amazing. Self hype, self hype, self. <laughs> That's kind of surprising. I can't believe I hit the target with the buckshot. That was sick. Yeah, I just like, hip fire. Yeah. Oh, I hit the target. Boom! <laughs> <laughs> that was awesome. This is real life Call of Duty. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I was going to say three out of the semi auto mag dump. Something about a semi-automatic shotgun just sounds so cool. <laughs> I have a couple. <laughs> so we're just gonna we're just gonna send. Uh... It's supposed to be open this far, Chris. No. Huh? It's not closing. Yeah.
There we go. Now it's closed all the way. Uh, Have a piece of debris get caught in it? Yeah, being really temperamental. Yeah, it's closing all the way now. Maybe there was a little bit of gunpowder or gunk that was just stuck in yeah. there. Yeah, there we go. Okay, I think we figured it out. Yeah. Okay, you gotta do it with the buckshot then. You have to have a smooth run, dude. Don't complain about your shoulder hurting. This is fun. <laughs> that just seems like you're forcing me to be here. <laughs> mm-hmm. You're my guinea pig for my video. Oh, this is Jace, by the way. <laughs> right there, that's when it does like the... Yeah. gummy pig. His name is Jace, by the way. Did I put three in? Yeah, I did. What do you think about that guy? It's nice. I think it's a buckshot gun. Yeah, I think it is too. Yeah, she's getting a little. I put my hand on it to load it. And it's I was like, like really hot. Yeah. Do you dare me to lick it? <laughs> no. Is it? Is, is it? Are you filming? Yeah. <laughs> oh, that's hot. <laughs> that's hot. <laughs> that's hot. <laughs> Don't that's you hot. wish your shotgun was hot like mine? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> oh my God, Becky! His buckshot is so big. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe we're yeah, the no, problem. So you're saying three inches enough. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I'm pretty sure how I did it was buckshot, then two buckshot, and then three birdshot, and then a buckshot. So I'm going to do buckshot, buckshot, and then three birdshot, and then two buckshots. Winning! Yeah, so you'll do two buck shots, two bird shots, and then two buck shots again. There you go. He took the top off of that second one. He just grazed it and it spun the cap off. Oh, uh, yeah. <laughs> just be like three inch high brass double out buck. One fifty grain. One hundred and fifty grain. All right, you filming? Yep. All right, so the two two three almost went through this plate, so we're just checking to see if the three hundred eight will do it. Okay, let's take a look. So this is the definite hole. This is what it's doing to our not hardened steel. However, two two three is doing this. <laughs> so, should I flip it around again because we know which one it is and I'll hit it with the 303. You ready? Hmm? That was definitely a hit. Huh! Not quite through, but pretty close. A little bit bigger hole? Yeah. There we Where go. We, going? we are live. Three, 
water bottle at 100 yards. Got him. I gotta try something. I gotta try something. I got it. I got it. It's really hot. <laughs> it's really, really hot. But I caught it. <laughs> of course I would, wouldn't I? <laughs> yep. <laughs>